give and to receive this wonderful trophy. Again, family is being congratulated. Thankfully, Nadia, I guess I know step safely with that wonderful prize from the Japanese Weekly. Beautiful to have on your sideboard, original, and of course, presented in person. That's the Stan Raymacher's trophy. Unusual, but certainly unique, and certainly better, I would think, than the more conventional silver cups. Yes, there's certainly a night to remember. For all the Huben family, friends, and fanciers from all around the world. Ruben, Jeff, Luke, and Nadia. Not forgetting, of course, Evelyn and Cindy. The next big evening in Belgium, of course, is the World Championship evening, sponsored by the famous Versa Lager Company of Corn. There's the trophies. And yet again, the Rubens are there. Wherever success Ruben family are there to have their share of the honours. Congratulating and being congratulated. Marvellous team spirit, the Belgian pigeon fancy. Gifts exchanged. Jeff, having in such of honor, by one of the directors of the Versa Lager Company, being again congratulated by each other. What a proud moment for the Huben family. This World Championship really means what it says. It's open to all pigeon fanciers around the world. And very, very many different nationalities are attending in this marvelous evening of celebration and honor. Again, in 1993, another golden dove was won by, yet again, the Huben family. Again, Jan Hermans extolling the virtues of a wonderful family from Eidelton, whose life, thoughts, work, and the betterment of their own marvelous family of racing pigeons, which have bred so many winners to so many people, wherever racing pigeons are played, as they say in Belgium, or kept, as we say, in England. As always with these events, the Belgium national anthem is being played, and courtesy is shown by all therein. Jan Herman's congratulation, Nadia, and of course Luke. Crystal, flowers, Truly, night celebration yet again for the Hooper family. These photographs will be shown in all the press throughout the pigeon world, and as many. American, Canadian, British, of course. South African, Australian, Canadian, Dutch, German, Portuguese, Swedish, Danish, 
all European countries, all pigeon papers will have all these wonderful photographs of the famous Huben family, yet again, winning top honours. At the Huben home, we have visual evidence of their success and successes through the very many years. The collection gets bigger every year. Bronze, silver and gold, priceless in these trophies. And they represent many great victories for the Huben families. For example, the first national yearling from Bourges, first and second national Argentine youngsters, three national aged pigeons, for example, with Sonny, who was second national age pigeon in 1985 middle distance. Robin, seventh national age pigeon in 1991. Young Capitan, the ninth national age pigeon middle distance in 1993. Also, of course, among the trophies is the Garden Dove Trophy of 1991. Overall world champion, second from Versa Lager in 1993. Best loft of all Belgium by the Rouse Dub newspaper. First provincial champion, long distance Antwerp, 1994 and 1995, showing the true versatility of his family of middle distance, longer distance, and most people will win from them for short distance because they are truly family of all-round winners. The evidence is there for all to see. And of course, the Huben family's name will live, will be edged in stone wherever racing pigeons are raced throughout the world. Well, celebration of another kind. It's birthday. Birthday time for Jeff. He's 70 years young. And being held in such esteem by his friends and relatives, they turn out to celebrate with Jeff. chat of old times, good times, perhaps some of the bad times. But tonight's is Jeff's night. Evelyn, his loving wife. Yes. His daughter-in-law, Monique. Friends are plenty. A wave to the crowd. Nadia also adding her congratulations to her dear old dad. And now the apple of his eye, his granddaughter Cindy, is going to take him to, unbeknown to Jeff, a very uh, important part of the evening's proceedings. Because he doesn't know that the chairman of the Belgian Bont, K, or the English equivalent to the RPRA, Marcel van den Drisch is going to present him with a badge of honor for 50 years in the sport of pigeon racing. It's a great honor to which Jeff readily accepts. Very few are given and very many congratulations, sincere congratulations are offered to one of Belgium's all-time greats. 70 years young. Yet another exhausting evening coming to an end. In Belgium, there was a very famous writer called Felix Timmermans. And it's been said that he's taught the people to read. People today in many countries, say of Jeff Huben, that he taught people and fanciers throughout the world to race pigeons.
young artiste, one of the top players of the Huben family, star of Sonny, Chippy and Robin, and very, very much more. Sonny, one of the flag bearers of the Huben family. In 85, he was second national ace pigeon, and besides, he won sixth and ninth national Bourges. Robin, a cracking racing cock, seventh national ace pigeon, third Olympiad in La Palmas in Spain. Chippy, a super racer of the Huben family. He won first national Bourges against 7,848 pigeons, and also the father of a Rockefeller, who was 11th national Bourges against nearly 18,000 pigeons.
Montiga, a real cracker, and sire of an international limoge against nearly 19,000 pigeons. Young Capitan, nine international lace pigeon, and won six nationals and balls against eleven and a half thousand pigeons. Chanty, all the ancestors go back to the originals in the 40s and 50s. He bred Herbie, who was fourth national borge against 10,000 pigeons or more. Tretscopia is a fantastic breeding mother. She is the dam of Chippy, Robin, Capitan, and Halla, and also the daughter of Gomer van Bruggen's Kreitzka. Kirby. He won six national Bourges.
the brother of Robin and Chippy, and sire of four very good racers. He is also the sire of the first provincial orleans against 12,500 pigeons.